Why don't we take my car? You have a car? Yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> That is so cool. That's just the dust cover. The cat has a car, the uh, SLOW. 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 Yeah, slow. They created a car that I can't say the name of that's really hard. Here she is, the super luxurious. Super luxurious. Omnidur. <laughs> The super luxurious omnidirectional watch a jigger It's better than the last thing we had. The super hydraulic instantaneous tr transporter, or... No! Quick to the slow! It's the new thing. It has red smoke that looks like fire. It's so neat. The SLOW has been this uh, great project. It's a very strange three-wheel combination of boat, plane, and car. The vehicle design developed from sketches that Bo did, and we have a great vehicle designer called Harold Belka. He and I worked together to develop the car, and at the same time worked with props for the sort of objects and things that it had to do. GPS, check. DVD, CD, check. Someone from Czech Republic is a check. <laughs> It was set up so that the kids and the cat could sit in it, and there was a blind driver. He drove by watching a monitor that was hooked up to a tiny camera in the front of the car. Wait! Two people can't drive at the same time? You're right. We should all drive. I am, you know, also very much a, a kid at heart. And I wanted to drive a slow. I wanted to have a model of the slow. It's very nimble because it was a three-wheel vehicle and the steering wheel was in the back so it could turn on its own two wheels. I think that the props in the movie are exactly how you would bring the book to life. Can we do that again? 